by Benjamin Seeker, and this is Seek Brian TV. Brian is sweet. Sweet Brian TV presents Did You Know Blizzards? A blizzard is a very strong winter storm that lasts at least three hours. The difference between a snowstorm and a blizzard is that a blizzard has to have winds that are sustained at 36 miles per hour or 56 kilometers per hour, and it must limit visibility to 400 meters or less. Although lots of snow and very cold temperatures are normal, they are not needed for a storm to be considered a blizzard. Blizzards can be found all around the world. They are common in Canada, Russia, Antarctica, and the U.S but they have even been seen in Australia, Greece, and Iran. There are a few dangers that come with this violent storm. Very cold temperatures that can lead to frostbite or hypothermia. Loss of power to your home from the strong winds can mean no heat or electricity. You can even end up being trapped in your home for days because of the amount of snow. It also can cause terrible driving conditions. The Snow Winter this was a series of storms that lasted from October to March, 1880 to 1881. Many people believe it was the most violent winter ever. The storm of the century. This happened in 1993 and killed 310 people. The storm was so large, Cuba was even affected with a very high storm surge. 10 million people lost power and it caused billions of dollars in damage. Great Lakes Storm of 1913. Winds of 140 kilometers per hour in the province of Ontario. Waves were over 11 meters at night and produced whiteout conditions. 250 people were killed, 19 ships destroyed, including the SS Edmund Fitzgerald. So my advice if you hear a blizzard's coming is to stay at home and be sure you have lots of food and water available. Flashlights and batteries are also a good idea. Don't forget to have some of my brother's favorite drink on hand, hot chocolate. Did somebody say hot chocolate? Yay! So now you know. Thanks for watching Sweet Science TV. Science is sweet.